you go. Okay. Hello, I'm Jillian. I'm Aston. We're going live for the first time. If you join us, we'll answer any questions you have. Otherwise, we want to just introduce new species, especially to those of you who might be new. Maybe you were referred to us, and the person that referred you did, couldn't really explain very well who we are or our products. We wanted to give you an introduction today. And of course, again, if anyone joins at any time and you have any questions, just chat them and we will answer them. So, Aston, do you want to? So I, I am Aston. I'm the founder of uh, New Species, and we want to talk to you today about you. How can we use New Species to help you? Of course, you know that New Species is a corporation that has raw, natural, organic products or formulas put together by scientists, doctors, herbalists. Of course, we at New Species, we invented those formulas to help you to detox, cleanse, rebuild your body so that you can live better, live longer. Now we have NDs, naturopathic doctors, uh, that is, we have them on board to help you with consultation to get into your health goals. So during the course of uh, this session, we are making ourselves completely available to you to ask any questions, uh, make any comments. We'll do our best to answer your questions. And Jillian. So I was hoping we could talk a little bit about, since um, Asin, you founded New Species mm -hmm. 15 years ago. About. And you were doing a lot of charitable, charitable work even before that. About 10 years before that. Right. Yeah. Do you want to say a little bit about what that, what that was, was for you and then how that led into you deciding you needed to design or invent your own formula? Sure. So my father is the impetus of New Species uh, Formation. Uh, my father died of prostate cancer. He was diagnosed and two years later he died. Uh, the doctors we had, supposedly the best doctors in, in the whole Caribbean, they told him that he would live his long full life after surgery to re that removed his prostate. But after t about two years, the cancer came back. And when it came back, it was in his bone, his liver, his lung. And he was pretty much, you know, going to die according to what the doctor said. So I saw him go through the suffering of medication, of chemo and radiation, and they didn't work for him. Unfortunately um, for him, you know, none of that work. And for me, I have a bunch of brothers. I have actually nine brothers and I had uncles and I had a family, you know, members who were male who I was looking at thinking what's going to happen if, you know, any of us should get prostate cancer. So I, in, I found a new species to help people, not just with prostate cancer, but in general. Mm -hmm. And we invented the first formula, the LNU-1, that's helped thousands of people during the period of time where we were just a charitable foundation. We weren't a corporation, but because we helped so many people, people asked us to make it available, actually guilt us into make it generally available to the world. Mm -hmm. So that's how we had to form the corporation because we gave it, we made them in the early days and gave them away. We gave away maybe 30,000 more than that. Yeah, when I, when uh, I first... Just, just, free, just free products to people. Right. And then if we're going to help more people, unfortunately, we had to make it to sell. So that's right. how the corporation was formed. Well, I remember when I first started, I had finished with that chapter in my life, and I had decided to officially full-time join Aston in what he was doing. I had met... I went to a family gathering at your sister's house. Yeah. And I met family member after family member who had been given a bottle of the stuff, as they that's call, what they, that's what they call it. Yeah. it back then. And um, one person had an autoimmune disease called Sjogren's disease. It was a more rare one. She said that that had gone away. Um, she also had a tumor on her one of her glands, mm -hmm. and that had gone away. Her thyroid. Another... Uh, another family member had high cholesterol, another one had high blood pressure, and, and just on and on, people getting these results. And so at that point, I was like, all right, well, I guess we're doing this. <laughs> yeah, and we, we took to the streets after that. Yeah. Mount Vernon, the Bronx, we were driving all over Mount Vernon in the 
Bronx, you know, meeting people in their living rooms, in their dining rooms, at their dinner tables, just talking to them about their health, what to eat, what not to eat. Right. And uh, we weren't really good at selling anything back then. We weren't selling. We always got into these long conversations about agriculture and organics and all that stuff and why raw food was important. And uh, we really weren't as well as good at selling stuff. But so eventually we opened health centers around New York. Right. We just kind of followed where our phone orders were going. We saw a lot of people in this area, so we would open up there. And, and so now we serve um, multiple locations. We have, right now, Aston and I are in our headquarters in Beacon, New York, in the Hudson Valley. And we have a retail storefront here, so we do see a lot of clients here. Dr. Bowman, one of our naturopathic doctors, is actually here right now. She's seeing clients um, and talking to many people on the phone. So we've come a long way. We have, yes. <laughs> we have our naturopathic doctor, Dr. Guy. She's in Elmont today seeing clients. That's in Long Island. It's right on the border of Queens. And our other naturopathic doctor, Dr. McDermott, she is in our Brooklyn location in Canarsie. And we are currently relocating our Atlanta location. Um, but we, we are, we've been down there for several years. Mm -hmm. And we also have a location in Montego Bay, Jamaica. So... Getting started with new species, what does someone need to know? Because a lot of people say, all right, well, what is this new species? Is it a supplement? Is it a juice? Is it a tonic? Is it a tea? They don't understand what our products are. It's they all are of really the above, different. None of no, the it's not. None of the above. <laughs> but people, you know, they do call new species a tonic. Some people call new species medicine. You know, we get a lot of different uh, variations in terms of uh, how people see new species formulas, but mm -hmm. they actually are raw natural organic formulation that have vitamins and minerals but they have herbs they have plants and Jelene is going to try to get the original <laughs> and new one this is uh what put new species and planet earth yeah so this, this is the very liquid, first one but what makes our formulas liquid is the vegetable glycerin that's what keeps the raw herbs alive mm -hmm and protects the potency of the formula. So it's only liquid because the herbs are raw and they're in vegetable glycerin. So a lot of people are used to an herbal tonic, which the herbs are processed with heat, and then in order to preserve them, alcohol is added. Right. And so that's the typical herbal tinctures you'd get in a health food store. New species formulas are really different because we are trying to gear the products towards um, rebuilding the body, helping the body rebuild itself. Mm -hmm. And so we wanted the, the, the plants to be raw. And so that's why they're the vegetable glycerin, and that's why most of them are liquid. We do have a question, though. Hi, Kamoy. Um, Kamoy is asking, do we offer a diet plan? So we do. We actually have uh, the naturopathic doctors. One of the best ways to get to us is to make an appointment with uh, myself. It's free. The appointments are the, free. The appointment with Aston free or the doctors. Or the doctors. And bring your labs in. That's, you know, if you have any blood reports, if you have any MRI reports or PET scans, CAT scans, bring them in, bring everything in so you can get a free consultation, a free evaluation of your labs so that the doctors can decide what, you know, you really need to do. Very often people believe they know what's wrong with them, but when they sit down with the NDs and talk with them and other the doctors, that they realize that they were way off. From my experience, 99% of every person who believed they knew what was wrong with them, nothing was wrong with them. So it's interesting, when, when it comes to diets and weight loss, it can get a little more complicated because new species is always about the root cause of the issue. So you could go on a diet and you know restrict calories or restrict an entire food group, whatever all the fad stuff is that's out there right now, and you will lose weight. Mm -hmm. Will you keep it off is really the question. And that's where New Species is really passionate about making sure whatever solutions we provide our clients, that they're actually going to give you results and it's going to become a new lifestyle for you where those results are going to last you for the rest of your life. So we don't offer a diet plan in the standard way where you're going to get a menu and we're going to tell you exactly what to eat and then you're going to lose weight. Um, so if you have pre-existing health conditions like diabetes or high cholesterol or cancer, all of these things could also impact the foods that you, you can eat where you might find that a lot of standard diet plans then don't 
uh, account for those factors. So if you were to see acid and say, well, I want to lose weight, and then he looks at your blood work and sees that you have diabetes or any of these pre-existing health conditions, he's likely going to say, we should really address these issues that are burdening your body systems first. And in a lot of times, in turn, just getting healthier helps you lose weight naturally. And then if we need to take further steps, our New Life program, it's on our app. You can download New Species app right off of the App Store or the Google Play Store. And that's going to give you a lot of suggestions for healthy foods. It isn't going to give you exact recipes, though. So if you're interested in seeing what I've been doing to lose weight on uh, my own plan, it's really about discovering what works for me and the same strategies that I use. You can apply to figure out what works for you. I don't think there's one thing that works for everybody. And that is also on our app. It's our show, Scratch the Surface. And I'm documenting my own journey trying to figure out weight loss in a more unconventional sense as opposed to the standard diet. So uh, come and have your free consultation and I think that can help you get more context as to what you really need to do to accomplish the goals that you have. Right, so when it comes to diet plan, right, the issue there is we could create a diet plan for you with whole foods, natural foods, you know, or uh, ground produce. And because you have diabetes or high blood pressure or high cholesterol, you have certain types of infections, whatever the issues you may, you may or may not have. You have a thyroid issue, you have digestive issues, certain foods you should not be eating. So we take it at the scientific level where we need to see your labs to see if anything is wrong with you. If something is wrong, then we would advise you what foods to eat and what foods you shouldn't eat. Even if they're whole foods or natural foods, a lot of people who come to us there are certain foods that they should not be eating, even though it's whole food, it's ground produce because of the health issues they have. So send us your labs or your blood report and we will do a free evaluation and then we could make a recommendation. But the simple answer is yes, we do have, we do have diet plans. Got it. And, and actually, um, Olivia, you're watching. We have one of our team members helping moderate today. If you can pin a comment with our fax number, that would be really great. I'm going to just chat it here. It's 347-696-7965. So you can safely fax your blood work or any, any information you have there. Otherwise, if you're going to come into the office and you're not comfortable faxing for whatever reason, you can just bring them in and we'll scan them at that point. Kamoy is also asking, can you help with the blockage of an artery? And I think this is a good question and I think this takes us into the, we should explain a little bit how new species helps the body rebuild itself, mm -hmm. that we aren't treating um, any particular diseases, we're not curing anything, mm -hmm. how our products actually, or even our programs, not just our products alone, how they help people deal with any kind of health goal, including right. blockage in an artery. So let's give you a brief overview as to how we would handle a health issue of any kind. If someone has a black artery or they have high cholesterol or they have calcification because of the poor uh, digestion and, and, and the body's use of calcium or other minerals, what happens is that the body is breaking down. The body is not able to uh, rebuild itself the way it should, and possibly the body is not able to clean itself the way it's supposed to. Our liver, our liver ha has enzymes and amino acids and other proteins that the body uses to, to clean itself and detox itself, to purify itself. So if you have a black artery, the formulas that we have, like the El New one that Jillian just showed you a while ago, it's a rebuilding formula to help, help to rebuild not just the immune system, it helps the body to rebuild all the organs and all the glands. We have herbs and plants and other whole foods in there, including, including vitamins that are formulated by our, our doctors and scientists to assist the body to rebuild itself, meaning that it re, uh, would rebuild the cardiovascular system. That's what would be implicated here in a blockage in an artery. And then we have the detox, um, if, if Jillian can grab it really quick, we have a detox system that the body will use to help to detoxify, cleanse, and purify, its, purify the body. So even the detox is raw, natural, organic, all herbs, plants, and whole foods that are in it that the body will use to assist itself in detoxifying itself. 
So between the rebuilding, the detoxification, that's primarily how we have helped our clients around the world, tens of thousands of clients around the world, to uh, have a better health in terms of the body finding the root cause of these issues. In, in, your, in this case with the black artery, we don't know what the root cause is, but the labs would assist us in determining you know, what the root, cause, root causes may be. Mm -hmm. So our formulas help to rebuild the body to, to fix root, root problems, to get rid of root problems, the detoxification, the same thing. It helps the body to root out any uh, underlying root causes that could be causing the black artery. Mm -hmm. And if you go to new species, uh, newspeciesfoundation.org, I'll type that in here, all of our testimonials are here. And we do have um, at least one really amazing one up there, but there probably are a bunch more of people who've had that same issue and what they believe, what they did, how they worked with new species, um, and they believe that it helped them get results. Um, and then there's obviously plenty of other testimonials there too, including weight loss ones. But, but you know, getting us a lab is key though. We need to see what could be causing the black artery. Mm -hmm. That is fundamental. Otherwise, we wouldn't know where to go with uh, making a recommendation as to what to do. Right, right. So it's interesting because what a lot of our potential clients and current clients have to learn over time as they work with new species is they have to adjust their mindset. So if you've been in the in the, the network of the medical industry, meaning that you've gone to your primary doctor, then they, they realize there's an issue, they recommend you to a specialist, then you go to that specialist and they say, well, you should go to this specialist. And now you've seen a ton of specialists, you've been on and off a bunch of different medications and you really aren't getting anywhere. It's because uh, they're looking at symptoms. So they're saying that, okay, this organ has this problem, go to your cardiologist. This organ has that problem, go to your urologist. And then you're all over the place and everyone's just treating symptoms. So you're probably really used to thinking about your health in terms of what symptoms do you have. Mm -hmm. Even in the case with a disease like diabetes, uh, it's really a set a bunch of symptoms that have all come together to create what we call diabetes. Mm -hmm. And the same thing goes for most health issues. So if you're looking at your body and what's going wrong as symptoms, you're missing the underlying story. You're missing what's really going on in your body. That's where new species kicks in. That's what makes us very excited about the work that we do because we're able to use any blood work or any documentation you have from your, the, your medical experience to actually look at what's going on in your body and say, okay, do you see this? Do you see this and you see this? They're actually all the same thing and this is why. And we can educate you about what's happening in your body and then when we make a recommendation for the new species program that you should go on, we know that we're addressing the root cause of the issue. So you might think that a blocked artery is the problem, but the reason it got blocked is actually the problem. And that's what new species likes to work with. So most people will call us and say, what do you have for high blood pressure? And our, we will never try to sell you products over the phone based on that question. The first thing we will say to you is that we've helped a lot of people with high blood pressure, but for everyone it's different. And you need to just come in and have your free consultation. I want to ask a question. If, uh, the, if they have high cholesterol. Christina says hi. Hi, Christina. Marcia Scott needs to order again. Okay. Do you know we have a discount this weekend, Marcia? <laughs> Uh, if you get if you're on our email list, you should see it. If you're on our, our app, you should see it. By the way, Marcia has got a one of the earliest time going yes. back to Mount Vernon days. I remember. Back. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, Christina, do you have high cholesterol? Oh, I don't know if she'll be able to respond here. No. Oh. Yeah. Um, and they may not want to say here, but okay. certainly follow up and book that free consultation. Uh, I know a lot of people prefer to do it over the phone. We really prefer you to be in the office because we take this we take this really seriously and we know we know what the process looks like. So after you come in and you tell us what's going on with you, we're going to then educate you about all these things that are really going on. And then we're going to give you a program as to how you can move forward. It's up to you whether you want to purchase or engage at that time. You can go do your research and come back. There's never any pressure to buy anything or spend any money. Actually, we have never asked anyone to we buy don't any ask species. anyone to buy. We just tell you what we think we you should do. We don't stand in the street corner and give out flyers. <laughs> no. We've never done that. <laughs> we'll never do that. We're right. just making ourselves available to people, right. you know, to help. Right. Yeah. 
But the reason why we insist you come in person is because that whole process really plays out much better in person. It's really hard to get into the details over the phone and help you feel comfortable and convinced that we might be the right partner for you with your health. So please, if you can, um, it's not as simple as just going to the doctor, you say, I have this issue, and they write you a prescription. We're really getting into the root causes and education. So if you can come in, please make the time. Marge Bishop Spence has a question. My doctor says these findings are not approved by the FDA. My friend stopped taking his blood pressure medication and started taking his herbal treatments and died from a massive heart attack. That's a really, really interesting point to make. And that's very, very sad. Yeah, I'm really sorry um, about that. And, and this is why, uh, Marge, that people who have health issues should go see a professional if they plan to do natural treatments of any kind or remedies they really should see a professional because a professional like <clears throat> excuse me or endies would never tell someone to come off their medication only a doctor should even hint to anyone to come off their medication right and the doctors would do that marge only after probably a series of examination based on my experience, what I've seen happen over a year, and the doctors see that someone's blood pressure or the health issue they have is subsiding or is gone completely. And even when it's gone completely, in the case of high blood pressure, the person you, you know would go for a year of their pressure being normal before the doctors uh, take them off the medication. So anyone out there who's listening, if you have any relatives who are taking any kind of remedy of any kind, they should stay on their medication. Their doctors should take them off the medication. Now, all of our formulas are, you know, our ingredients are approved by the FDA. Right. And even though our formulas are approved by the FDA, we still say to all our clients, stay on the medication, only your doctor, only your primary care, can advise you to come off the medication. So those of you who are who are listening and watching right now, that is what you should advise your family and friends, and that's what you should do if you're ever on medication. You should never come off your medication unless your doctor specifically take you know takes you off the medication. Right. And, and if and you're having side effects from the medication, what do you do? You go back to your doctor immediately or go to the emergency room and advise the doctors that you're having side effects on the medication and let them prescribe something different. Mm -hmm. So that's where we're different. Yeah, you and Marge, from other companies we, out there. we've had clients come into the office because they've used our products before, they believe that they've helped them with their conditions, and we always say our formulas are supporting your body, your body is regulating itself. Our products are not a treatment, they're not medicine, although a lot of our clients do call it their medicine. Um, we consistently, say that that is not what our products are for. They're supporting your body and your body has to regulate itself. And that's why we, we go into such detail in our consultations because even if our formulas are really helping someone, they, if they're still eating a lot of certain kinds of foods that don't work for their body, if they're still under extreme stress, if they are uh, not sleeping, there's so many other factors that affect your health we would never claim that our formulas alone are going to be the solution for a health problem. Now, having said that, we've had clients who already have used our formulas. They work for them in whatever way. And um, we had a client once come in and say, my blood pressure is really, really high. What do I need to buy? And our employee immediately used our blood pressure machine to check his blood pressure, saw that it was dangerously high, and called 911 and sent him to the emergency room. And that's our process. Yes, we never claim to be treating anything. We completely believe that medication has its purpose. If I go outside and get hit by a car right now, I want surgery, I want pain meds, and I want doctors and surgeons to help me and take care Absolutely. of me. Absolutely. Absolutely. Nutrition is one part of the health puzzle. That's why we now have naturopathic doctors on staff because so many of our clients have pre-existing conditions and take medication and they're taking medications we want staff that's trained to help them do both to nourish talk, their body we should talk about our naturopathic doctors and what they do and we what should. their qualifications so are quickly, so that's uh, a great question marge thank you for asking thank that you question so much and you um, just hit the nail on the head right there for me for us so our naturopathic doctors sorry, mabel says hi hi mabel I'm, mabel richards hi mabel <laughs> 
Um, so, so some of you who are joining now, you don't come to see us, come to see us anymore. <laughs> so I guess it's the only way we're going to be able to talk to you is on Facebook because you believe our offices are too crowded. That's about, that's the, that's the reason, by the way. Which is a good thing, I know. <laughs> but but our, our, our naturopathic doctors, they're trained in natural um, remedies or naturopathic, and they're also trained in medicine. So if you are on medication and you come to New Species, you get an appointment with one of our naturopathic doctors, they can advise you both on your medication that you're taking, and they can also advise you on any of our natural formulas that you're using, mm -hmm. which, you know, all our formulas are natural, raw, organic, whole foods. So they can advise you on both, on both levels. And that is the primary reason, Marge, why we have brought on board and put to the forefront of new species our naturopathic doctors. Which their services are free. New Species pays them, you do not pay them. So there's no excuse for anyone you refer to New Species to avoid sound, seeing our naturopathic crazy? doctors. Do we sound crazy <laughs> that we have NDs, naturopathic doctors, and their services to you and the community and to the people are for free? Hi, Elder. And by, and by the way, the we, 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 pay them, we pay them a lot of money. <laughs> And we don't charge anyone. We have never charged anyone no. for a consultation. To be clear, what, what we do charge for is the bioscan. And that's we should talk about the bioscan and the kind of information it provides. We do provide for that cert. We do charge for that service. That's only if you choose to do it or you really need to do it. And why do we have it? We okay. have it because a lot of our clients don't um, have health insurance because we prefer all of you to get a, a medical report get a labs or get, you know, get your PET scan, your MRIs. We prefer that to our bioscan, just so you know that. But we have a lot of clients who, probably thousands of clients, who don't like doctors and who are afraid of doctors and they will never get a blood test done. So we believe that the only way that we can gauge or have an idea as to what's going on with them before we make any recommendation as to what they should use from our, from new species is to offer them to do a bioscan. Want to explain what the bioscan and how it works, Joe? Right. So the bioscan is um, it's magnetic resonance technology. So the same so is non toxic. Right. It's just two probes that you hold in your hand, and through those probes, using magnetic resonance. So no body parts are taken. No blood. Right. No, no blood. Fluids, no needles. No urine. No, no urine. feces. Okay. No, none, of, none of that. It's something right. we can easily do in our health centers. And uh, you hold on to these two probes, and the magnetic resonance um, actually can read everything that's going on with all your body systems, and then it prints out this really detailed report. So you are, as Dr. Guy had explained to me really well, is that you're, all of you are familiar with magnetic resonance imaging right MRI because that's when the doctor needs to see more or know more about your health that's the test that they send you for this is not imaging right but it is magnetic resonance and it can read everything that's going on in the body in the same way and so we recommend that when people don't have anything else to go on maybe you don't have health insurance and you can't get the blood tests or the other tests done so it's just a really it's a health, it's a way to fill in the gap for anyone who doesn't have that information already um, I wanted to say though, it, it, is, it is an interesting reality or a phenomenon for us to actually, it could be harder to help the people that believe in herbs or believe in natural or believe in new species wholeheartedly and, uh, because that kind of person will believe that herbs can heal them or treat their condition and then would go off their medication. Um, and those are people that sometimes we have to really argue with to say this is not a replacement where they'll call and say, well, this is happening. And then we'll say, did you go off your medication? And they'll say, well, yeah, I'm taking the products. And we say, absolutely don't do that. That's very dangerous. Eventually your body can rebuild and get stronger, but we're nowhere near that yet. And your doctor has to determine that. So uh, that's just a great thing, Marge, that you brought up. Um, Marge also asked, uh, said also some medications can interact with present medications. I think Marge is so educating. <laughs> She's a new species. So education, educating them on that too. Um, and then Marge, you said re you asked radiation. Um, if you can explain further what you mean by that, we can we can answer that. 
Uh, and Mabel said she's a regular at the Brooklyn office, so you just don't get to, I guess, see her as often. Yeah, they hide away from me now because they believe when a man is crowded, so. but that's not fair. <laughs> she said she doesn't, though. Thank you, okay. Mabel, for sticking with us. So let's get uh, to that other question. Where the medications can interact. Yeah. That is true. Medication can in interact with other medication. Medication can you know, interact with even with herbs or whole foods. So that's another you know, really, really profound question there because what we do at New Species, our herbs, our plants, and our whole foods that make up our faunas, we actually embrace completely the FDA and the FDA and regulations. The regulations. Absolutely. So as soon as the FDA you know, says that this herb can interact with the medication or this herb or plant or food is not good for human consumption, we immediately remove it from our formulas. We remove it. We remove them completely from our formulas. So, so, and then because we have our NDs, you know, who have all this knowledge of medication, they have all this knowledge of uh, of, of herbs and naturopathy. They are able to also advise our clients as to, you know, what interactions that could come into play with what they eat or what they drink outside of new species. So those of you who have interaction with your medication, whether it's foods or other, or other medication, you can come to our NDs and speak with them, get a consultation and speak with them, or you, you definitely should go back to your doctor, go back to your primary care and discuss these issues with them. Right, and luckily we use herbs that have been around, been used by humans for thousands of years, so we, we really don't end up having any of those interaction issues. But Marge was specifically saying about medications interacting with medications. Right. I, I want to get to a point about that quickly, but I do want to say hi to Mr. Lawson. I, I apologize. I just don't want to mess up your name. Um, hey, I'm waiting on my product. I'm very excited to start. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, I can, if, if you think you've been waiting too long, uh, let me know. I can check on the package for you. Always or checking it anyway. We'll check on it for you. Um, radiation about the imaging. Oh, for MRIs. We... We probably, Marge, we're going to stay focused on, on what new species does. I don't want to say, uh, we don't probably shouldn't speak about MRI and radiation. So, 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 so just so you all know, we, we do not, and I'm not saying that you are or you're implying, but we actually embrace people taking medication. We are not anti-medication. Or the testing that might be necessary to find out what's going right, on. Right, but you, you know. yes, we understand that a lot of the testing they do is toxic. Right, and I don't think our bioscan could replace magnetic resonance no, imaging in, no. in a lot of cases. No. Right, right. It, again, our the bioscan is, is not going to be a replacement for what the medical industry does, but it is there for people who may not have a choice. Well, it's there for people who will not get a medical exam or from their really doctors. choose not to do we it. Prefer we, don't a blood test. we prefer a blood test. We prefer a, a, fe a fecal matter test. We prefer a urine test. Right. But a lot of our clients will not go to a doctor and others don't have health insurance. So again, it's the only way to at least minimally gauge what could be going on with that client. Right. And that's why we're using the bioscan. Right. And and so Marge, that's a good it's a good point that yes, there there can be downsides to a lot of medical treatments. There there can be side effects or radiation or toxins or and things like that. That's true. And so new species always talks about the difference between having a chronic condition and then living the rest of your life not doing anything but just taking medication and getting scans and tests. Um, we believe you should be an advocate for yourself and take your health into into your own hands and say, all right, I'm, I'm using medical treatments to get by, but what can, else can I be doing to help my body rebuild itself? And that's where new species comes in. And it's also why we have our naturopathic doctors, because like you said, some people go to one doctor, get, rec get prescribed a medication. Then they go to another doctor and that doctor doesn't know they were prescribed that medication. They prescribe another medication and this, and then those medications can pile up and interact, cause liver failure, really be a problem. And our NDs are here to, are to fill in those gaps, to connect everything. So mm -hmm. if you're seeing all these different doctors who don't necessarily know what each each other is saying, our ND can look at everything that's going on with you and then fill in the nutrition piece and make sure that you're being properly taken care of all around. And, and we always say, oh, I mean, I always say, I don't know if Aston would agree, but 
if you're with a doctor who believes you have to be, have high blood pressure or you have to have diabetes the rest of your life, if you're with a doctor who believes you need to die with that disease, maybe you should just get a second opinion. Maybe you should find a doctor that believes you can rebuild your health and they're there to treat you while your life is in danger. But if you are on your part doing the nutrition side of things and letting new species guide you to rebuild your health on the natural side, then that doctor will willingly help you get off the medications. And those doctors do exist, and you should find, find one for yourself. I'm going to defend you know, those doctors for, for just, just a few seconds. I have to so, say, hi, Sturton. So a lot, of, a lot of doctors will tell you know, their patients that if they have diabetes or blood pressure, it's for life. If they have any health issue, it's for life. If they have herpes, it's for life. Now, why do doctors say that? I believe that they're saying that because there is actually, <clears throat> excuse me, no known medication that will definitively cure diabetes. There's no known medication that can definitively, you know, cure high blood pressure and a lot of the other health issues people get. So yes, you go to the doctor and let me play devil's advocate. You go to the doctor, you have diabetes. The doctor says, okay, you're going to have this thing for life. I think partly what the doctors are saying there is that you have gone for so long and didn't properly take care of yourself and you have diabetes and now you have diabetes, it's, it's getting worse. You're not changing your diet, you're not changing your lifestyle, you're not exercising, you're not taking good supplements like new species because a lot of our clients take new species to their doctors to get verified that it's good and they can take it, which all of you should do. And the doctor's conclusion is that, okay, here's a person who has gone for all these years and never took proper care of themselves. What is the likelihood of them taking proper care of themselves in the future? I believe, and I hope I am wrong, that's why doctors would say if you have diabetes, it's for life. But people who have come to us with diabetes and who change their diet, change their lifestyle, take the formulas we recommend, do what we ask them to do. We have seen their A A1C has gone from 13 or 14 to 5.5, 5.0, uh, which is normal range. And then we would say to them, go back to your doctor to verify that you don't have diabetes because we can't tell you you don't have diabetes even though all your numbers are normal. Your glucose is normal, it's below 100 or it's below 80 or right at 80. Your A1C is 5.5 or 5.0. So looking at your labs, you don't have diabetes, says your lab, but your doctor needs to tell you that. But we believe that the body can fix anything if the body gets what it needs to fight the root cause that causes those health, health issues. That's what we believe at this feature. And that's what we have proven, I would say, tens of thousands of times over the years. Mm -hmm. And as in what you're saying, uh, I think is a perfect example of why you should have a doctor that actually believes you can rebuild your health. Yes. Because a lot of clients, one, they're, hi they're hiding that they're using new species formulas from their doctors because they either already asked and the doctor said, no, you shouldn't take that because the doctor doesn't know anything about herbs or- Some of them get into fights with their doctors. Right. I mean, some doctors are just going to say no to anything that they are not trained on because legally they don't want any kind of liability. And, and they, they, they also just is. don't know. They're not going to tell you it's okay if they're right. really- I mean, they should say that but but they don't but the point is is if you have a doctor that believes you can rebuild your health and then they they see a, a formula you're taking or a product you're taking that's natural there's no additives no chemicals it's all just the names of food on the label um they're gonna say all right let's see what happens and then when you're your blood sugar, let's say, regulates and it's stayed regular for a period of time, that doctor can now guide you through lowering your dose or coming off your medication over right. time and then say, all right, it looks like it looks like you don't have diabetes anymore. And that's what I have seen with, you know, with our clients who whose numbers are normal, their glucose normal, their A1C normal, the doctors have taken them off the medication. Mm -hmm. So if any of our clients actually want to recommend or big up a doctor that you go to that is that believes you can heal and rebuild your health and, and you, that you use new species and they know it and they approve, recommend that doctor um, here in this comments or on our Facebook. However, let us know who they are because we would love to share it with other create clients. a database and share those people with other clients who can't find these doctors.
So if no one else has any other questions, I think we can wrap up this session unless mm -hmm. there's something you'd really like to address. No, I think we've, we've gotten some really um, extraordinary questions and uh, uh, we were taken down the path to addressing certain client issues and just general issues that people face in their lives. Mm -hmm. what, I what I would want to repeat is that those of you who, or if you know anyone who is taking remedies, herbal or plants or or nutritional remedies for their blood pressure or diabetes or cancer or whatever issues they have, I can tell you this. A lot of the people who come to me, they're taking their guinea hen weed and all those herbs with their cancer. Mm -hmm. And I have never met a person who was on their own ignoring the doctors taking these herbs who ever get better from their cancers. In fact, they all get worse. Some of them would go to the Caribbean and they come back with suitcases of uh, herbs that they're boiling and drinking. And I guess they go on YouTube and they're told that these things will cure their blood pressure, their diabetes. I'm not saying that they're on cases. I just mm -hmm. haven't seen or heard of one. Mm -hmm. So when it comes to people taking their medication, you should encourage them to take their medication. You should encourage them to go to their doctors. You should encourage them to get their blood tests done. And you should encourage them to do what's right, you know, and what's right is they should listen to their doctors and if they don't like their doctors, do what Jillian just suggested, go shop for a doctor. Like you go to a store, you buy a pair of shoes, didn't fit, you take it back. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing, I think. Right. Um, so if you don't have any other questions, that's fine. I really, really appreciate your participation, Marge. Those were really awesome questions. And um, thank you for your support today on our first Facebook Live. We hope to keep doing this. So any of you who are watching who want to recommend family and friends and you just don't know how to convince them or explain that new species is the right Turn thing for Facebook them, Live. just send them to our, our broadcast. And let them ask questions. Let them ask whatever they need to ask. Uh, skeptical people are our favorites. Uh, we really know that what we do is because the they, right thing and, and the skeptical ones they, they turn out always to be the most loyal yeah and listen what we do might not be right for everybody so we're perfectly fine if someone's got questions and their expectations are a cure or, or something like that then we'll just say hey that's that's not what we do but uh, if someone is really looking to rebuild their health and make a life change actually change what they're doing every day the same actions that got them sick they're now willing to cut those actions out or adjust them and then add new species in and let our team for free guide you to health those are the people who really benefit from new species and uh we we're excited to meet them so if you if you have any of those people send them to our our facebook live broadcast and also if you can't make it to a broadcast but you've got more questions that were really great like today just email them to me in advance, Jillian at newspecies.com. I'll type it right here, and then we can address those questions next time. So this is going to be the norm for us. We're going to you know, make ourselves available to take your questions. If you have issues, you have problems you know, of any kind, uh, you want to know more about new species, you want to know more about our formulas, about our NDs, which is naturopathic doctors, how we help people, cancer, diabetes, blood pressure, prostate. Um, a lot of ladies fibroids. come to us with fibroids and ovarian cysts, you know. Um, just, just just shoot us questions or, or, or join us and ask us those questions. We have, I think, a massive amount of information to share with the whole world, partly because, um, I should say primarily because we've been around for about 20 years and we have talked to one-on-one -on -one tens of thousands of people worldwide. We have read their labs, we have read their MRIs, their PET scans, their CTs, we have read their blood reports, and we have helped you know, a lot of people. So we have a wealth of information to share with you as to how you can live better and live longer based on how we have helped other people, mm -hmm. or even how we haven't helped other people, especially those who have end stage four cancer and how you can make sure you or your family or your friends never get to the stage where you have end stage, any, any health issue. You want to die with you know, at the ripe old age, 
then you should talk to us. We can help guide you to do that. Mm -hmm. So you're welcome, Mabel. Absolutely. Please join us again. Lorene. Uh, Lorene is a regular in the Mount Vernon office. She says, thank you for our time. She really enjoys the segment. Lorene, you're welcome. You're welcome. This, this is what we love doing, and we're looking forward to more of these broadcasts. So we're going to turn this into the, this is going to be the new living room and the new uh, uh, dinner table like we used to do in Mount Vernon. Or in oh my gosh, days. the internet, right? This is going to I be know. Yeah. Um, we do have one more question, though. Sure. Arthur. Hi, Arthur. Uh, good afternoon. With the detox, how often should I use it? So the standard instructions for the detox are morning and night, every day until it runs out. Um, most of us new species just always take it. It's perfectly safe to take every day for the rest of your life because it's not a washout. It's not going to cause it's I mean, whole foods. Right. It's not going to cause diarrhea. It's just natural whole foods that help clean out your intestines. So yeah, take it twice a day, every day. You can take it until the container runs out. If you're not ready to buy it again, then um, we su suggest at least two times per year. You do it for the whole two months. Unless you're advised by one of the naturopathic doctors that you should take it more. Right, and also some people need to take it less. It really depends on your lifestyle. So for me, if I drink a green smoothie in the morning, have a cup of coffee, and take the detox, I'm going a lot more than if I didn't do all those things. So it, it does really depend on your lifestyle. And if you need to make adjustments, you can just call the naturopathic doctors, tell them your situation, and they can help you adjust it. So thank you everyone for joining and for making this uh, real, uh, helping us to kick this off. Um, <laughs> we were prepared to completely talk to ourselves. So <laughs> I, enjoy, I enjoyed it. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you. We'll talk to you next time.